I'm Cindy from Startup World Tech and we are doing a co-interview with Aving News from Korea on the K Startups this year at Switch 2022. So the Switch uh, event is actually the Singapore Week of Innovation and Technology and we are going to interview some startups. In our class, we usually have the speedometer, the, all the different levels and the entertainment system separated. But right now, we are going to combine the two of them. And how do we do it to combine the two and get a new infotainment system? We are going to talk to uh, Mr. Kim. We are going to talk to Mr. Kim. Uh, to find out more about his new infotainment system for cars. Hello, Mr. Kim. Hello, Mr. Lim. Uh, can you tell me more about what this is? This is DreamAce's cockpit system. It means basically integrated digital cluster and central information display via our own operating system. So, uh, who is it targeted for? The first target is the new electric vehicle maker. And then we expand the two uh, conventional OEM and used car market. So what kind of benefits does it bring for the users? Uh, the first benefit is cost competitiveness. Uh, because we just use single AP for up to six display, so we reduce the parts cost and uh, software license cost. So, does it mean that uh, no matter what model of the car, what brand of the car I'm driving, I can use this? Of course, any car use the cockpit system because the CAN database is the standardization, so we can use uh, the data and provided the integrity cockpit for any car. So, what are some of the examples that we can have here? And this, this is definitely the speed meter and the oil level, right? The, what about here? Only the maps? Uh, 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 ba basically, basically uh, provide the navigation system. Um, and also, in, in addition to uh, provide the OTT service like YouTube and oh, Netflix okay. uh, during the charging the electric vehicle and also providing Android games to the okay. so, customer. So when, uh, when your friend is driving, you can watch TV and such. Okay, that's great. So uh, any plans moving forward? Any future plans? Any future plans? <laughs> uh, now, uh, we are focused on the new EV maker in Korea or overseas and next step, we are going to found uh, conventional and uh, old uh, car makers to provide our platform. Okay. We will be planning to have this system available in Singapore too? Yes, of course. We we arrived a uh, taxi yesterday, and we saw the uh, tech cluster and AVN displays of uh, the car. So we thought uh, we have a uh, competitive to uh, ordinary solutions. Yes. Thank you so much, Mr. Kim and Mr. Lim. Thank you. We hope to see this in Singapore really soon. Thank you. Bye-bye.